Hello and welcome, Neil Ellis here from Tykes TV. How's everyone? Ready for weekend? Ready for football? Uh, I think we all can agree on that. I'm going to give him a predicted uh, starting a starting eleven. Uh, should be a bit of an interesting one. Uh, bear in mind, there were a few changes for Cup came up in Carabao Cup. So we'll get straight to it. Uh, Bound predicted starting eleven against Ipswich Town. Back into league. That's what it's all about. Try and get in uh, some wind under the belt and moving up the league. Uh, I'm going to go with Brad Collins. No, against uh, Walton, but I think kind of uh, makes his own mind up. Donny Duff, who's going to be in an art uh, side come uh, league. But again, it's no reflection on um, Walton this, but I think Brad Collins will be back. John Nellywell, um, sorry, John Nellywell, Jordan Williams. I'm just trying to think that the person that maybe I would like to see give him a bit of game time to see how he'd handle it is uh, Jordan Nellywell. Uh, but again, Williams, we know he had his injury issues and that, and he got rested, but he came on in cup. But John Nellywell, I thought he had a steady game, uh, didn't over elaborate on much, kept it simple, basic stuff. A bit of a learning curve. Is it just going to be used for a cup games? I, I'm unsure about that. But for me, if you know, if for a change there, I could see that happening. But is he going to start with the same side against uh, Wickham last time at league? Anderson, Captain Mads. I can't see any changes being there. I think um, everybody's come through last game with a clean bill of health. So, Captain Mads, I think he'll be starting. Kundi. I think he'll start in place of McCarthy. I thought McCarthy didn't have one of his best games against Leeds. He can wait for the kick and, you know, caught, got caught a few times out. Gundy, um, I could see him starting. I could see him starting against uh, Ipswich. And Kitchen, um, I think he started off the season pretty, you know, not impressive, still learning. And confidence is like starting to come through a bit. It's starting to come out with the ball a lot more. Ever to cover it like a left wing back role, uh, quite a bit to be fair, especially in cup game as well. So yeah, I can see uh, that being the same back three. What started at Wickham and Styles. I think Nicky Cadden's still out for a another game or two. I think he's had a bit of setback, so I'd move Styles back from out of midfield, which you were in Leeds. Back left wing back role. So again, when you look at the back line, uh, you know, your three central defenders and your right wing back, left wing back, same as Wickham, uh, albeit Jordan Hellewell stroke, Williams at right wing back role, but I'm thinking he's moving like to go with that one. Benson, uh, he looked a bit tired, he looked uh, done in kind of thing, running centre ground, covering a lot of area, covering a lot of space in midweek game against Leeds. Would it be a game that um, either Benson or Thomas will come on to a bit later, will be rested, and Matty Wolf or uh, Akroy come in? Um, just to freshen up and change up a bit, or is it all good and there's no injuries, no niggles, and it's good to go? Um, I think we all agree that Benson's one of the players what was, what's in form. Up until Wickham, he was three and three. So again, uh, you you would go with Benson. Luke Thomas. I could see if Luke Thomas got rested, I could see Jack Aitchison coming back role, the attacking advanced midfielder kind of thing. I could see that happening if Thomas won't feel in right hundred percent. Aitchison played in that role as attacking midfield kind of thing at Forest Green Rovers, so it's it, it's a. Uh, it's a, a position that he's uh, familiar with. We're also using that position as well, as I believe, against Middlesbrough and um, Hill Stage at Cup as well. Luke Connell got rested because he played with uh, Styles in midfield, didn't he? So Luke Connell got rested. So you're thinking that Luke Connell will be starting in that role. But you've got options. You've got options on the bench. You know, you've got Mighty Wolf, you've got Will Mark if he decides to freshen things up or beef it up a bit or he's happy as it is. Devante Cole, again, trying, 
really trying to create space to help ball up. At times, he didn't have a lot of support. So for me, I would start with Devante Cole. Who will start alongside him? I'll go with Aitchison. He could go with Norwood, being at um, Ipswich, back at Ipswich, Hunting Ground. If I were case, you could see him probably resting Thomas and putting it and dropping into that. Or another player what I were impressed with, Slobodan Tedic. For me, he seemed fresh, he seemed bright. I thought he brought the best out of Devante Cole when he came on in the second half in the Cup. Does he want to run the games? Does he need running games? Would it work out for him? Who knows? If it were a choice I'd make, them two, you probably, you, you know, Duff might want to sell up on the same side, but, you know, more or less the same side, but uh, finish, start the game, sorry, against Wickham. Because I want to see that commitment, I want to see the body language, I want to see the desire, everything. Because, you know, for things, certain things that were missing, which were highlighted. Or I did see enough in the midweek game to think, yeah, he deserves his spot. Because we came off a, a Bristol Rovers game with an unchanged side, didn't we, straight after? And a few people saying, yeah, unchanged, yeah. But is it time now that, hmm, this player, I think he's done all right in Leeds game, plus in training, is with a, is with a shot or is on bench? But Slobodan, I'd like to see him get involved a bit more because it looks like Lady Zach is nowhere to be seen in for Steam set up. So why not? Why not? So again, it's all about opinions, isn't it? Would you would you start with the game, the setup, uh, with the you know Wickham Wanderers, or would you mix up a bit and freshen it up a bit? I don't know. It's all about opinions. Let me, you know. Have your say below. Let, let me know your your comments. What you think? Going to be same system? Is it going to be same players? Away at Ipswich Town, we're going to be a test. But then we've got a midweek game coming up as well, aren't we? And then a weekend, so there's a lot of fixtures coming up. So, got to bear that in mind about squad rotation. So, that's my predicted starting 11. I'm interested to hear what, uh, I was going to say guys, but there's guys and girls out there. Let me know your squad prediction as well. Have your say. That's what it's all about. It's just Town and Bounds. Have your say in the comments below. Squad predictions. Team selections. A variety of things what you can get involved in. One thing left to say, you're right.